All right, I'm ready. All right, shalom, shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praises, honor, glory, respect, and blessings to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Racha Kodash. Salutations to the Lord's elect on the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth in sincerity while patiently waiting for Yahweh Shai's return. And as always, I would like to give double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone, which have taught us everything we know through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. Welcome to another in transit, being brought to you through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. This is the brother Yashamai coming back at you with another in transit video. And this video is going to be uh, food for thought, okay? You know, we must all learn how to accept rebuke because rebuke is how you become stronger in this truth, okay? Rebuke is how you become a man, you know? Now, we're not perfect, you know, we're all going to make mistakes. We're all going to mess up here and there. But what did the scripture say? A righteous man follows seven times and get back up. <sighs> so, uh, you know, when you get rebuked, instead of getting all butthurt about it, accept it. Because it's much better to be rebuked by your, your own brothers than to be rebuked by Yahawah, Yahawah Shai, even though man's goings are of the Lord, right? When you're getting rebuked by a brother, that's really Yahawah Shai speaking through that brother to you. Okay? So when it comes to getting rebuked, you know, you got, op you got options, right? You could be rebuked by the Lord's flame of fire when he, when he returned. Or you can accept the rebuke from your brother, which is made to um, make you stronger and learn from it that you may receive salvation, right? You know, because, I mean, let's face it, we, we, we've all fallen short of the glory, correct? You know, our righteousness are as filthy rags. But every single day, we are aiming to be that better person. You know, hey, that's the video. You know, aim to become a better you. We all should be aiming to do that, right? All of us should be aiming to be a better version of ourselves. And that's where the rebuke come in. You should always be ready and willing to rebuke yourself. You see? I know I rebuke myself sometimes, you know? It's so, you know, keep our emotions in check. Keep my emotions in check. Because it's, this truth is not about me. This truth is all about, you know, serving Yahweh while Yahweh shy, while working out your salvation with fear and trembling. When you, once you understand the importance of that, then you learn to become a better brother. With that, I'm going to say, Shalom. It's on to the next one.